Gray in the number 17 to the outside lead of the racetrack. Green flag is out, and we're back on your way. Gibbs in the top five tonight, running in the fourth spot. One car goes to the outside. That is Drew Dollar. Nobody went with him. He'll lose the third spot to Ty Gibbs in the bottom. Richmond Water Heater, sponsors of the Halfway Leader Award in each Arkham and Art Series event. Richmond Water Heater is in the big Drivers left on the short shoot, coming right back to the tri oval. Lap number 50. Next in line on the bottom, he runs in fourth, side by side with Ty Gibbs for that position. That's where they begin to stack up side by side about 12 cars in that second pass. Yeah, Ty Gibbs is going to need a little more help up there, and he's going to need a car to get closer to him. Settle it here at Daytona. 
Here we go. The pace car comes to pit road. The field will get the green and white flag together, and it's on. Corey Hahn will get away, but Drew Dyler will come back. Just a bit from third place, Brad Holmes. Now Himes out front by a car length and a half. Is that too much? Is it going off third four? Exactly, a little bit of a gap between first and second. Here they come. Checkered flag in the air. Last two checkered. Here's to the The Daytona give it up. Your race winner today, Corey Hines. Straightaway, Drew Dollar on the vision screen took one last ditch effort to try to get by, go to the high side and time the draft such that he could make that last run to the tri-oval but just did not have enough speed. With the damage on the left side, you see Corey Heim 